Alan Dodge. Mary D. Dodge. Mike Dodge. I fell in love with the place. It was pretty raw. There wasn't a lot of art going on. Uh, we worked in Spokane early on, uh, off and on, with some architects there. But we met great friends and people, and it became our chosen family. And uh, that's why we stayed and why we're still here, other than it's gorgeous and everything like that. Love the climate, but... I don't really have anything to add to that, because <laughs> I'm with him. <laughs> uh, we raised our kids here, big fish in a little pond, and they turned out great. We adored the, this entire area, and now they've moved back with our grandchildren, so we are locked. <laughs> the garden the Green really has been a major part of the reason and, and what we've worked on while we've been here. And our goal really was to bring in uh, more art and promote art in this area. And I, the difference between when we came here, when there was a tiny little festival and nothing else going on anywhere uh, uh, except velvet paintings hanging in people's living rooms, it was pretty awesome how it is now with all these festivals going on and all these public people art. coming to see on. it in the public art and, and so, so it's a huge change from when we moved here. Yeah, I think uh, a friend of mine once said, when are the, when are the people going to move here that will support the arts? And, uh, and they're here. So I think times have changed and we've been discovered. And, um, it's an art seller's market. It's a great place to be. Keeping, keeping this momentum uh, that's going on right now would be a, a great challenge uh, and, and grow it and get more people understanding how important art is to the community itself and to people outside the community when they come here. This is a tourist town now, I guess it always has been. Um, and uh, that's why people come here. That's why people want to see your town. What do you do here? What's going on? And I think public art is probably one of our greater challenges to keep going. I think uh, that our biggest challenge is going to be management of our water resources. Because I think that in the future, and all the people that are going to be coming here, because the western United States is going to dry up due to climate change, and I think that's going to be a major challenge in the Pacific Northwest in general, and Coeur d'Alene for us in particular. I think given the, the current political climate, be nice to everybody <laughs> and don't be divisive. Try to get everybody on the same page with the common goal of a great close-knit community, which is a little divided right now. So I think that's, that would be my goal, is to help put this place back together somehow, some way.